What is up everybody? This is Easy. Easy Street Gaming. Got a new some some new content. We have a new island. Um new characters. There it's called the Dragon Kin. This is the this is where they will be built right here in this uh this new part of the map. Uh, th we're gonna have three that I can see so far. Right now only Rage Horn, the very first one is available to us. The other two are not available quite yet. There's a lot to it. I'm gonna try to go over as much as, uh, as I can. Um, you're gonna upgrade Rage Horn as you upgrade it. I'll tell you how. Um, I'm sure a lot of you already know how to, uh, how it's working so far. There's a there's a lot of ways you can you're gonna be able to upgrade this for free to pay. Um, but as you upgrade, you'll get a, a number of very important skills. Uh, he has several different skills that uh, that happen to the stronghold, that happen to your troops, that happen all. Uh, there, there's just tons of stuff that this guy's gonna do for you. Um, I've got mine already to past level 10 so the first ability that you're gonna see here is called inspiration It's actually the second ability the first one is called building and it increases your percentage on, on all of your buildings um, Inspiration actually increases your attack and defense for your troops. So as you upgrade His uh, as you upgrade his level his, his skills will change and then as you upgrade his actual skills you can actually upgrade his he has a number of skills like the first skill is called knock and it just damages the enemy troops you can at, at the max level it damages like it kills 30 percent of the troops so um that you damage it's kind of it's, some of this stuff is going to be kind of complicated and I'm, I'm not going to cover it all in this video but i want to get as much as i can uh the second one is called building and it, it increases your construction speed and um, at max level it's like 40 percent so it's a 40 percent boost on your construction speed once you get to max level to max this thing out it's going to be tough though guys um inspiration it increases the troop defense and attack um once you get it maxed out you'll have a hundred percent over what you have right now so you can see another huge improvement this this is going to be now granted everyone's going to have it so it, it, it should level itself off uh the next one's called warrior defense it increases the defense of your warriors so it does specific boosts to different different troops as well uh, the next one's called resource it increases the resource production at max level it does 40 percent it does a 40 percent um, boost on all of your resource production so i think it's like five percent boost every time you upgrade it so this is one character that does a lot i mean it really does a lot and next is called group defense it increases the defense for the shaman and for the beastmaster now if you've noticed on the left side of the screen I, I've been kind of labeling what each kind of ability is you have uh, Legion abilities you have active abilities and then you have these aura abilities that those are three different abilities that happen at different times during the game uh, then the next level is called rescue this is getting towards uh, the, the end of his abilities uh, rescue but basically it converts a certain amount of dead troops into the hospital so if they kill X amount of troops it, um, at max level brings 16% of all the dead soldiers back and put them in the hospital if your hospital will hold them. So that's pretty cool. Now you can also evolve the star level just like you can uh, evolve your heroes. You can increase the star level of the dragon can of rage horn and as you increase the star level you'll also be um, in for every new star level you'll have talent effects that go with it uh, at two star your building your building speed goes to 10 percent at three star it reduces the cd of the active skill four star your troop capacity goes out five star uh, you get this insta kill of five percent of all the troops so, uh, six star your troop capacity increases again and then at seven star this goes all the way to seven star um it adds another um insta kill of five percent so this is uh some uh, I can't say it enough how, how much of an impact this is going to have if you've been watching the bigger players you've already you see that they've already got you'll, you'll see a little later on in the video how far ahead some of the guys have already have this uh, these characters they whenever something like this comes around you, you have to kind of put, change, switch your focal to it because everyone else is going to and you really don't want to fall behind on something that's this vital that has this many different uh, that has an impact on this many different parts of the game so you will receive two different things you'll receive um food for him 
and it's gonna be I believe it's gonna be in your special lineup so you'll go to you'll, you'll go into your um, your your bag of tricks your bag or whatever and um, you'll see the secret dragon dragon fruit that is what you feed him I think you have to have five at a time to feed him and as you feed him the fruit he increases in level so now levels not star though so you can't just feed him fruit the fruit and get, and get additional stars you'll be able to increase his level but you won't be able to get the actual star which the additional stars actually come with additional skills so you'll want to increase his level because as you increase his level you'll increase the certain skill sets and um, and then as you increase the star level you'll get even more uh, more more attributes with that so if you go if you if you click on the question mark they have this this is all in game um, it, it explains how you can actually level up the dragonkins. There are three ways you can feed them. You have the free feed. They give you they give you some food every single day. Then you have the the secret fruit seed or fruit feed. Uh, if you'll notice that you'll see an exclamation point um, on top of Ragehorn. Whenever you see him talking to you, then just click on him and he'll give you certain things. He gives you stuff all the time. He'll be constantly giving you food. He'll be constantly giving you uh, the shards. You need the shards. You collect them. Once you get a hundred of them, you'll you'll be able to go up from the level one to level two. You'll increase the star level, and you'll get additional skills for that. Um, basically, on both sides, whether it be his level or his star level, you get additional skills uh, for on, on both sides. You can level up their skills with what's called dragon crystals. You will get some free every day. Uh, you can also buy them in the shop you can buy all this stuff um, unfortunately it seems as if there's gonna be a lot of buying if you want to advance this really really fast but for the free players I, I think that there's actually a lot of chances to get free stuff so I, so don't don't uh, feel bad if you're a free free player and you're not like you're gonna fall way behind it's I've, I've actually fed um, rage horn many many times on, on all my accounts and I haven't paid for a lot of it yet I've, I've just done a couple of little one dollar and um, and four, I a couple of 499. I've got one of them like level 17. I got one of them to level 11. So you'll be able to upgrade their levels uh, uh, with a lot of the free stuff too. Uh, you'll unlock them with the shards. And uh, I haven't got any for the next one, the Tyrannosaurus. Uh, I, I don't know what it's called. I think it's called Tyrant. So uh, I'm sure once the game is ready for us to be able to unlock the next one, then you'll start receiving those shards. Uh, as it is right now, you'll receive the Rage Horn shards, and that will help you unlock the um, the next uh, star level, I believe it, it is. And again, if you want to go and read all the stuff for yourself, just click on the attribute for uh, for Rage Horn, and then click on click on the question mark, and it brings you over to this this page right here. It goes into what his attack means. Um, he kind of has a unique attacking ability. You don't see them attacking. But in all of the of the reports, it will show you how many troops the uh, the Rage Horn kills. And I did something just incredibly dumb. Actually, I asked uh, another player from the server to attack me because I wanted to I wanted to see for myself exactly how the report showed everything. And so I sent some troops to a collection. I was going to send a thousand T1 to the collection, and I asked a very strong player from my, from our from our server to attack me and I carelessly ended up sending 42,000 troops to the collection and so he sent uh, 300,000 troops to that same collection as I asked him to and look at that look he's already got his four star rage horn four star he ended up killing 5,000 of my troops with rage horn itself um, I, I me being a uh, tactical genius lost a million power for and I asked you know I asked for it I had literally asked um, one of the strongest players in the server to attack me and take a million power from me and uh, he did it for me had to twist his arm a little but he did it <laughs> gotta do some dumb things sometimes but now on the on the bright side of it <laughs> if there is a bright side after losing a million I I did win the serve the uh, the partner battle so you know thumbs up to that easy good job you idiot so, I wanted to show the, the partner battle just to make myself feel a little better I guess so remember, we now have the Dragon Kin. There's a there's a lot of information that you're gonna want to try to get familiar with. I know this video just kind of scratched the surface. I didn't. I don't have any secret information. I get information just like everyone else. I'm just kind of bringing it to everyone's attention. 
Uh, my suggestion is is to learn how to use now. Now remember you before you send your marches out You'll see another slot as you're loading up your heroes and as you're loading up your troops Make sure you load up the your uh, your dragon kin Eventually we'll have more than one so you'll have to choose which one. I believe you're only going to have one of each uh, um, Remember there's there's CDs to the, to certain skills so you can't just use all of their big skills all the time You're gonna have to use timing you're gonna, you're gonna have to use a little bit of strategy and we're going to learn a lot more of this as we go along. So, pretty cool stuff. New new stuff in the game. It's called Dragon Ken, New Island. We've got a, a, a new Dino Troop, Rage Horn. Leave a comment if you like the video. S sub to the channel. Thanks for everyone that has already. I really appreciate everyone. Till next time, it's been easy.